almost each and every car owner installs a reliable car alarm system. This vigilant guardian will alarm you of any attempt to steal or damage your car. When you leave your car at the parking, you activate the alarm system using a remote control. Each car alarm system package includes such a remote control or you may call it an electronic car lock switch. Such switch is also used to unlock the car when you need to drive further. A remote control is a miniature key fob which activates or deactivates the alarm system and switch on of diode controlling power supply. Sometimes this tiny thing gets in difficult situations. You can step on it or press too hard or press down with something. However, this is not the only reason for often remote control failures. Miniature buttons soldered into the electronic chipboard have limited lifetime. That's why they require frequent replacements. Let's open the key fob and try to replace the buttons. You will need 30 watt soldering iron, preferably with a cone shaped bit. Pincers, solder iron, and fluxing agent. First and foremost, you should desolder buttons without damaging the printed board. Do it carefully without overheating the leads and the printed board itself. Then solder new buttons one by one, applying fluxing agent to leads. Use a soldering iron to carefully smooth out button seats. Well, it is easy. Where there's a will, there's a way. Besides, it will help you in mastering your soldering skills. Now let's check how remote control works. Firstly, test it on a diode and then on your own car.